Hey Gemini, I'm here to do your reading. This will be a reading for the sign of Gemini. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and the North Node. This will be a reading for the next 48 hours, Gemini. <clears throat> Let's see what's going on in the next 48 for you. So I feel like you're working. I feel like you're at work. I feel like you're working on something. I feel like you could be like preparing like what you're about to say to someone in the next 48 hours. I feel like there's something that you're passionate about, but like you're like trying to speak about it or you're trying to like tell someone about it. I feel like you're trying to like um, present something. I feel like you're trying to present something that you've been working on currently. The Six of Wands, yeah. I feel like this is something that you you feel can bring you a lot of success. Like whatever this might be, this might be like you actually traveling to work because there's some travel here. I feel like you're traveling to work here. Some of you could have like, really worked on yourselves <clears throat> the past couple of days. I see you like putting like work into yourself. There's some type of work that you're putting in like so you can- I don't know if this is like your physical features or like you're actually putting work into like, uh, like a car. Some of you may be exchanging a car or something like that here. Exchanging your car for something better. I feel like you're- um, Right now, something is just a, a mystery to you. Something will be of mystery to you in the next 48 hours. I feel like it's like surrounding some type of transition. So wherever you may be transitioning to, I see it's like some type of mystery around it. Or there's something that you're not going to be like privy to when you travel here or when you do decide to travel in the next 48 hours. You could be dealing with a Cancer Gemini with the moon card here. You had the eight of swords and the six of pentacles, Gemini. So I feel like someone's battling mentally. I feel like someone's battling mentally on if they should give something to you. I feel like they want to give something to you. They want to equal give and take with you, but like they're battling if they should give you this equal give and take or if they should give you anything at all with the six of pentacles and the star, yeah. Because I'm getting like someone wants to fix something. So in the next 48 hours, Gemini, I'm getting you could be traveling to work here and like you have like a task to do at work. But like with this task, I see you like getting perks. I'm getting like there are perks that come with this task. And I'm getting someone is keeping this secret from you. Someone's keeping a secret from you here about like how good the perks can be. Or like how good your victory can be. Because I'm getting something to do with your victory. Some of you could be actually dealing with celebrities. Here with the Six of Wands and the Star, you could be dealing with people who are um, glorified who um, are like socialites, who uh, maybe are social media influencers, or someone who's just in the public eye. This could be you, Gemini, in the public eye here. Some of you could be industry people. With the Eight of Wands here, I feel like you're communicating something, something that you've been working on. And I feel like you'll be really happy with the end results. Someone's someone's afraid to like release. Like if this is like music, whatever type of work this is, Eight of Pentacles, don't be afraid to release your work here. Don't be afraid to release what you have to say. You may be afraid that the public may not receive it. You may be afraid that these people, whoever you're presenting to, whoever your audience is, you may be afraid that these people may not accept what you're trying to put out. 
or what you're trying to offer or give with the six of pentacles i feel like you're trying to give something that will be uh very satisfying or fulfilling to uh these groups of people or whoever these people may be whoever you're trying to impress or present something to gemini in the next 48 hours i feel like you're trying to present it in a way <clears throat> that they'll maybe accept it you could be trying to get someone to be emotional or open up to you emotionally as well, Gemini, with the moon card here. Yeah, king of cups. This could be like sound. I'm getting music. Heavy music energy here, Gemini. Could be dealing with the Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio as well. I feel like someone is very shady or very like... Yeah, I'm getting shady because king of cups, king of wands. I'm getting like shady with their emotions. I'm getting someone is very emotional and someone cares a lot and they're very passionate about you, Gemini. But it's like they're they're kind of like keeping their emotions like hidden from you. I'm getting like they don't really want to share any emotions with you. The Queen of Cups. Yeah, I get like they have a bunch of emotion, a lot of emotion to share with you. But they just don't. The King of Cups. Someone who kind of cloaks their emotions. The King and Queen of Cups. That's someone who's like cloaking their emotions. Very loyal though. Very caring. But they may like be a little bit stubborn with the King of Wands. Come on, Gemini, next 48. The Chariot. <clears throat> the Emperor. Someone could have gotten a toe. Someone's car could have gotten like toe, Gemini. Or someone's car will be getting towed in the next 24 hours. So you might want to be careful and check and see where your car is parked. With the Emperor card, I see someone being very mad. Could be dealing with an Aries. I feel like someone's very mad here. Or you're going to have to deal with like a very stubborn type of person, Gemini. Someone who's like, you know, very stubborn. Very hard to maneuver. The cherry, I feel like you're going to be dealing with someone of authority. You're going to have like a run-in with the authorities I'm getting. The moon. And I'm getting like this is like a mystery. This will be um, a secret to you. This is uh, something that you're not privy to. So you may not be expecting this run-in with the authorities. Like this just may be something that just comes up. Nine of Pentacles and the Two of Wands. Yeah. It's like you're not going to like what they're saying to you. Like whatever they're whatever they're communicating with you, Gemini, I feel like you're not going to like it. It's going to be something to do with you going independently or you doing something independently by yourself. The two of wands. So it's almost like someone's going to like send you on your way or something like that here. In the next 48 hours for Gemini. Let's clarify the Emperor, the King of Swords, yeah, and the Judgment. Someone's like really mad, like really angry and dark. So you could be dealing like with, you could be dealing like with a, um, a very dark customer service representative, something like that, like a very, you know, nasty, nice, nasty type of person, you know, evil, evil type of person, you know, mad because they have to be at work, mad because they have to do what they have to do. You know, sometimes we can encounter people who are uh, upset for no reason or people who appear to be upset for no reason. <clears throat> the seven of swords here, I'm sorry, the seven of wands here, I feel like something's not going to work. I feel like someone's going to try to be cunning with you. Someone's going to try to be very snide with you. King of Swords here in the Judgment card. Someone's going to try to place judgment over you and judge you like you've done something wrong. Maybe for being alone. Maybe for being independent. Maybe for uh, going at something independently or alone. Someone may pass judgment on you like, hey, like you know you can't, you can't handle that yourself or something like that here. With the Knight of Pentacles, yeah. I feel like someone will make you an offer because they assume that you can't do something alone. 
seven of wands, maybe after you've blocked them out, after you've shut them out, and you have a knowing, you have a knowing that someone may want to make you an offer here. You know this. This is something that you know, Gemini, that someone's possibly thinking about making you an offer here in the next 48 hours. Show me what else I need to see for Gemini in the next 48 hours. The Five of Cups. Show me what else I need to see for Gemini. Could be dealing with the Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, the Magician, the King of Pentacles. So I feel like you're, I feel like you're regretting something here. I feel like you could have, like you, I feel like there's a situation here, Gemini. It's almost like you're 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 talking too much. It's like you're talking too much. Like you're saying too much. I'm getting and you're going to regret this. I feel like you're going to regret saying too much or so much of something. King of Pentacles. I feel like you were too comfortable in a situation here, two of swords. And it's like now you're going to or in the next 48 hours, you're going to decide to stop talking. You're going to decide to close your mouth. I feel like you, you've you said something that maybe you didn't want to say. Or you said something in the heat of a moment and you didn't really mean to say it. The magician. It's like something came off the way it should not have, Gemini, in the next 48 hours. Could be dealing with a Virgo here as well with the King of Pentacles. I feel like someone is regretful for manipulating a Virgo here or someone's comfortability. Someone is regretful for manipulating someone's comfortability. So someone may be giving someone the silent treatment right now, Gemini. Someone may be acting like silent, you know, not speaking a lot, you know, just on mute, like a human mute. <laughs> the Ace of Pentacles here in the world. I feel like someone wants a new beginning. Someone wants to offer a new beginning here. But I feel like cycles have to close themselves out first. Cycles have to wrap themselves up first with the Seven of Pentacles. Because I feel like investments were made. Investments were made elsewhere. Six of Cups. Maybe between someone of the past. I'm getting like there was an investment made between someone of the past. Yeah. Yeah. I'm getting like someone connected with the person from the past or they I'm getting there's like evidence. I'm getting evidence of someone dealing with someone from the past. Nine of Cups and there this was their wish fulfillment. This is something that they wanted. They wanted to invest in this person of the past. This is something that they wanted, Gemini, the Knight of Cups. Yeah, this was their intention. Four of Pentacles, and they could be holding back from you. Nine of Swords, because they don't want you stressing. The Four of Wands, the Fool. Yeah, the Four of Wands and the Fool here. The Fool is the best card in the deck, they say. The Four of Wands, that's a relationship. Someone could be wearing a mask in your relationship, Gemini. In your home, whoever you live with, they're wearing a mask. And they're very passionate about new love, Gemini. This person who you're in a relationship with, they're very passionate about new love. Six of Swords and the Three of Wands. I see you moving forward in the next 48 hours, Gemini. You're moving forward to better things. You have better things headed your way. You have something new headed your way. You have new love headed your way. And you're going to have new opportunities headed your way within the next 48 hours. 
Sophia, the sun. The sun card here. I see you having like a bunch of brand new opportunities headed your way in the future. I feel like after you close out like cycles with this per with this person, I'm getting like it's certain things though. I'm getting like it's a bunch of emotional shit other than anything. So I feel like once you once you two or whoever you're in a relationship with Gemini, once you two figure out the emotional side of each other and what pleases each other emotionally, I feel like you'll have better opportunities to love on each other, if that makes sense. You'll have better opportunities to, you know, um, share with each other. Because I get with the Six of Pentacles, there's some type of uh, discrepancy amongst sharing with each other. In the King of Pentacles, that's almost like comfortability. So this could even be finances and emotional things that are affecting your relationship, Gemini, in the next 48 hours. <clears throat> Let's see. Let's get an Oracle card for you, Gemini. Hex, banishment, yeah. So I'm getting like, <laughs> there may be someone that you have to get rid of in order to get to this happiness, this sun card, <laughs> this ace of cups, new love, this ace of pentacles, new money, new opportunities, this ace of wands, new beginnings, creative ideas, passion. So I'm getting like, before you can get to that, there's something that you're going to have to banish. There's something that you're going to have to let go. Yeah, grounding. And you have homeland underneath foundation. So I'm getting some of you could be like homebodies. Some of you could be like homebodies I'm getting. And that's where you ground yourself at home. That's where you feel the most safe at home. That's where you feel the most stabilized at home. I feel like someone is trying to um, someone is trying to make you get rid of someone. That's for some of you, and I'm also getting someone wants like you to end your relationship, Gemini. Someone wants you to end your relationship. Someone's projecting onto you as well, so be careful. Let's get an angel answer card as well. I'm getting like someone's projecting onto you here. So you might wanna ground yourself, stabilize yourself in the next 48 hours. You have yes. I'm gonna choose one more. You have wait. So you have yes and wait coming out here. So there may be something that you may have to wait for but the answer is yes. I do see you getting what you want with the sun card. The ace of wands, that's a definite yes. Ace of pentacles, that's a definite yes. The ace of cups, that's a yes. There's, some, there's gonna be something that you're gonna have to wait for, Gemini. Let's choose a mystery card for Gemini. <clears throat> you have Cap Caribbean. <laughs> Caribbean Gemini. Are you dealing with someone from the Caribbean? Are you dealing with someone from the islands? Are you dealing with a foreigner? Are you dealing with someone from Puerto Rico? Haiti? Jamaica? overseas are you dealing with someone who's doing work on you gemini warlock underneath the deck are you dealing with someone who is doing work on you are you unaware 
like that someone's doing work on you. Yeah. Sugar daddy. Lip bite movie. You have big D. <laughs> you have big D here. You have movie. Could have went to the movies with this person. You could have watched a movie with this person. You could have watched Netflix with this person. You have sugar daddy. You have lip bite. You have heartbreak here. I get that this is someone who who's caused you pain. I get that this is someone who could have broke your heart in the past. I get that this is someone who wants new love here and you know that they do. I get that this is someone who is not very genuine with you. So I feel like you have like a bunch of greatness headed your way, Gemini. You have some things that you can look forward to. Some things that'll stabilize you and give you just what you're looking for, I feel like. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Check my description box so you guys can book a personal reading. All right, thank you, Gemini, for watching. Take care.